Living with Purpose. Hello everyone, this is Lori Lines of Higher Self Access. I am a QHHT Level 3 practitioner, board certified clinical hypnotist, intuitive and inspirational medium. Contrary to the famous movie quote, the meaning of life isn't like 42. And while the fundamental purpose of life is to achieve ascension, everyone's path to it is very different. No magic number, algorithm, or blueprint fits us all. The good news is there is a plan and your soul knows what it is. Where there is purpose, there is value. Our sole purpose is the reason that we have chosen to journey through yet another lifetime, this lifetime. The one caveat is that, despite having already selected our purpose, we must still rediscover it. Once we have reawakened to it, our mission is to nourish it and share it with the world. Discovering your sole mission is as vital to your well-being as it is to the collective. Your sole purpose is unique to you, and only you can put that essential piece of the universal puzzle in place. This is where sole purpose and personal values merge. Among the commonplace achievements and attributes that contribute to our worth, sole purpose is the highest level of worth and the most profound sense of purpose that we can have. Buddha, the stay-at-home mom, the person born without arms and legs, the CEO of a top-grossing company, and the baker at your favorite coffee shop. Remember that everyone has a purpose and no one's mission is any better or worse than the other. Let's take the baker for example. At work, they make tasty treats, yum. Their life purpose may be inspiring a patron to start their own business, bring comfort or pleasure to someone feeling joyless and hopeless. Nothing to do with baking whatsoever, like starting an animal rescue. Life purpose does not mean vocation. While some are fortunate enough to manifest a career that honors their purpose, our mission can be realized in any aspect of our lives through our nearest and dearest, strangers, or no individual in particular. When you discover your sole purpose, your life is enriched with deeper meaning. You are driven to nurture your talents, expand your reach, push past challenges, and set bold intentions. Full of motivation and will, your spiritual purpose fosters universal alignment and flow, allowing you to manifest the experience and realities that you desire and require to fulfill your unique mission and realize your true value. Every day you wake up is another day to share your gifts with the world, knowing that every personal pitfall pales in comparison to your universal impact. Once you are aware of your sole purpose, you can recognize what your purpose is and what it isn't. Be it relationships, goals, intentions, worldviews, or beliefs. With this heightened sense of inner truth, you can discern what choices further your mission or detract from it. In turn, you can release all that drains your energy, detracts your focus, and diminishes your drive toward your mission. This can free you from the limitations of the past, prevent present confusion and personal devaluation, and clear obstacles to a purposeful future. This way, you can be reborn as a person with inner value, purpose, discernment, and will. Ultimately, life's purpose is to seek a life of purpose. As long as you are seeking, you cannot fail. 
Sometimes it is difficult to find our value because our soul purpose is such an intrinsic part of who we are and how we live, making it nearly imperceptible. The best way to rediscover it is to simply let your soul speak. By asking meaningful questions and creating time and space to hear the initially quiet voice of your spirit, that voice will soon become a roar that drowns out doubt, fear, and insecurity. Here are a few questions to get you started. Review the past. What brought me joy as a child? Who were my role models growing up and why? What events of my youth, good or bad, were most impactful? Who did I aspire to be when I grew up and why? What did I want to do when I grew up and why? Present contemplation. What brings me joy now? Who inspires me now and why? What am I naturally good at? What am I intuitively drawn to? How am I most of service to others? Then draw your future intention by asking, How do I want to help others? What are my goals for the next year, five years, ten years? What makes me the most hopeful for the future? What are my dreams and desires? What do I hope to teach others? Remember to give your spirit time and space to respond to your questions. You may want to ask one or two questions before falling asleep, meditate on one question for five to ten minutes, or simply choose a question and open yourself to spirit's response as you move throughout the day. People often believe knowing the meaning of life and the personal value it brings is the ultimate goal or final destination. Yet, soul purpose is not a destination, it is a journey. Part of our purpose is to find our purpose, better equipping us to honor our mission and ourselves. Walking the path to rediscovering our soul purpose is essential to your healing, growth, evolution, and transformation. It is not the end, and therewithal it is the beginning. It is infinite. It is the why and the how, your incentive and your purpose. This beautiful quote by Buddha sums it up eloquently. Your purpose is to find your purpose and give your whole heart and soul to it. If you find my videos helpful or of value, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I wish you love and truth. I am Lori Lines.